Hello friends, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and if you're new, a special welcome to you. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to download and install the Google Calendar on your Windows 11 PC. And this is very easy to do. You simply want to go to google.com and ensure that you sign into your Gmail. Then click the Google Apps here from the uppermost right hand side. Then you want to scroll all the way down to where you'll find Calendar. Simple tap on that to open it. Now once your calendar is open, all you have to do is just simply click the three dots again, click save and share, then click create shortcut. And from here, all you have to do to set this an application and have it installed is simply click and open in a new window, then click on create. And from here, as you can see in the lower right hand side, that this is now an application and I can definitely use the application as you can see it here. This is my application of the Google Calendar that I can use. And to show you that this is an application, I'm going to show you that if I go ahead and I close this application here, then it will show in my computer as an application. So all I have to do, click the Windows icon here and simply type calendar. And as you can see, I have the Google Calendar shown here. I can simply go ahead and open the application here. Now you can also click the tree that's on the upper right hand side and you have uninstalled Google Calendar. How amazing is that? You can simply tap on that, simply click and remove. And that's how you easily remove it. So guys, that's it, guys. That's how you add the Google Calendar or install it on your Windows 10 or even Windows 11 PC. Now, guys, I really hope that you found this tutorial very helpful. And if you do, go ahead and give this video a like and share your comments below. I'd really appreciate that. And if you're seeing the channel for the first time, welcome to Drew Tutorial. I'm Anjo, and I really appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button below to help grow this community. And also, so that you'll never miss out when I release another helpful tutorial just like this one. Thank you very much, and see you next time.